How Glucose is Moved into Your Cells by Dalton Akos and Catherine Jewell. First, you eat food that contains sugar, which begins to be broken down into glucose molecules by enzymes in your saliva. This breaking down process is brought to your stomach and is called digestion. Then, these glucose molecules pass through the lining of your stomach and get absorbed into your bloodstream, where high levels of blood sugar signal the beta cells in the pancreas to secrete the protein insulin. The insulin travels along the bloodstream and attaches to receptors on muscle and fat, setting off a chain reaction known as signal transduction cascade inside the cell. The signal transduction cascade causes a channel protein known as GLUT4 to rise to the surface of the cell and open passageways large enough for the glucose molecules to pass through. This is known as facilitated diffusion. This process, called facilitated diffusion, allows the glucose molecules to enter the cell due to a concentration gradient. There is lots more glucose outside of the cell than inside the cell, so the glucose travels to the area with a lesser concentration inside the cell. In type 1 diabetes, there is not enough insulin made or no insulin at all. This is shown by no insulin going through the the bloodstream, or being secreted by the pancreas. Type 2 diabetes is shown by the insulin not being used properly.